Men of Reddit. How often have do? Do you change your walk because you're walking behind a woman late at night? This question is influenced by a video I saw where a guy explained that he was unintentionally the creepy guy because he was walking behind a woman in a park. As a woman it honestly never occurred to me that innocent men can be deemed as creepy just because they just so happened to be walking the same direction. Is this something you guys naturally take into consideration when walking? Edit. Wow I was not expecting this much a response edit. Thanks to you, OK Brother 2337 for sending me such a lovely message calling me a dumb, unattractive, attention seeker for just asking an innocent question. I've slowed down to create more space between but that's for both men and women. I compulsively overtake anyone walking ahead of me so yes, I guess. Almost every time. If she's walking slow I accelerate to pass her, if she's walking normally I slow down to keep a distance. I remember one time when I was walking home it was in the middle of the day. I was listening to music on my headphones and with both hands carrying groceries. Then I noticed that the woman in front of me was constantly looking back with a nervous look. I was thinking to myself, I'm listening to music, I'm hugging two bags of groceries, I'm dressed okay, how can I look threatening? After a while, she turned a corner and waited for me to pass. This is the type of situation that would really make me feel like I am being put in a box and profiled. But one part of me always goes, this is totally irrational which could mean this person has had something happen to them which would provoke an overreaction. Edit. I am finished replying to these. Can a single person out there acknowledge that profiling a man as a rapist isn't always the rational response to them walking behind you especially in the above commenter's case? Nobody's going to be annoyed at you for acknowledging that it's not always the correct thing. I'll even say myself that regardless of gender you should always be or of your surroundings but women especially have to shoulder this burden. Had a really fun time replying to loads of people on this it's an interesting topic. I think the one thing I learned is that we can agree or disagree about something but still acknowledge how it makes the other party feel. I usually just call out softly from the darkness don't worry. I'm not going to murder you and that calms women down, s yes. I often slow down or change sides of the street as a courtesy to women walking alone at night. Do I have to do so? Do I think all men should do so? No. But it's a minor inconvenience for me that could prevent a major source of panic for another person, so I suck it up and do it. I avoid every life form when walking at night. 